Dialysis membranes are available in a wide range of molecular pore sizes. 1 kilodalton, 3.5 kilodaltons, 6 to 8 kilodaltons, 10 kilodaltons, 12 to 14 kilodaltons, 25 kilodaltons, and 50 kilodaltons. Membrane strips must be hydrated before use. Each dry membrane strip consists of a pair of dialysis membranes that separate upon hydration. Membranes can be hydrated overnight in a buffer containing 10% ethanol. This provides ready membranes to most efficiently begin your experiments. Assembling the Teflon block takes less than 5 minutes. Bars in each set are labeled A to I and should be used in a sequence. To assemble the Teflon block, begin with the bar labeled A. Place a single membrane on the bar, cover with bar B, and repeat ending with bar I. Open the base clamp and place the assembled Teflon block in the base. Insert the stainless steel pressure plate between the Teflon block and the cam. The pressure plate allows the Teflon block to be loaded with 1 to 8 dialysis membranes depending on the sample number required in the experiment. Tighten the assembled unit with even pressure using both hands to rotate the cam levers. Fully assembled unit is now ready for use. Immediately add buffer to the dialysis side of the well to prevent dehydration of the membranes before the test samples are added. HTD units are fully automation compatible. Sample well positions conform to SBS plate specifications and are compatible with all standard 96 well pipetting equipment. Ready access to both sample and dialysate from the open top of the wells allows a simultaneous assay of 1 to 96 samples. HTD devices are compatible with a wide range of automated pipetting instruments.